here and reached her peak making swimsuit movies with Fabian. And uh, in this alternate universe, Woody Guthrie doesn't succumb to the Huntington's disease. He ends up in New York City in the late 1950s, knocking around Greenwich Village, where he meets Buddy Holly, who doesn't die in a plane crash in Iowa. Instead, Buddy Holly heads up to New York City, where he's already living. He goes down to Greenwich Village, and him and Woody together invent folk rock five, six, seven years before everybody else comes on. And, uh, so I imagine 1959, the Newport Folk Festival, Buddy Holly has just invented folk rock in front of the audience who are stunned, uh, and then they call up their hero, the audience's hero, the great Woody Guthrie. He walks on stage, he's playing a Les Paul gold top, electric guitar, he plugs it in, hits a resounding chord, and breaks Pete Seeger's heart before Bob Dylan even gets out of short trousers. So, that's where we are, kids. We're right there at that very moment. Buddy Holly and the Crickets have supplied uh, a rhythm for Woody. Woody has written these lyrics. What does Buddy Holly and uh, Woody Guthrie write about in 1959? Something that you Americans have always been obsessed with. Flying saucers. Yeah! Bye. 